back to my channel. We're gonna be testing out Gorilla Snot. This is my first time using it, so this should be interesting. But first things first, if you are new here. First off, welcome. Rain gang, welcome back for another video. All right, so point blank period. It's time to, why did I say point blank period? I, so this is not like nothing new, okay? But it's new for me, praise the Lord, saints. All right, so my hair is damp. No, it's dry. It's damp, it's, it's a little damp. So I'm going to go ahead and make a middle part. You guys know how I do. Yeah, and it's just because I don't feel like doing my hair, honestly. Um, I've just been in this season, huh, of just not in the mood for doing hair. And I don't understand what's going on, so. <sighs> You know, I'm just gonna go ahead and put it back. But we need to moisturize first, uh-huh. Y'all know, staple. I've officially put it in my staples. This is the Velvet Flow 4-in-1. Love it, mentioned it several times. Very hydrating for my hair. So whenever I'm putting my hair back, I like to go ahead and make sure that my hair is, of course, hydrated, correct? And if it's anything like that cream of nature, that's not, I had a whole video on it and I used it, it was, this was years ago. And I used it as like a wash and go because I think I saw my girl Juliana Palencia, Jujube, y'all know, Jujube is, and she used it, I believe, as a wash and go years ago. And I said, huh, well, praise God, maybe this is something that I could do and it was just horrible. With that being said, I'm having those expectations, huh? Those expectations. And um, I just don't, I don't have time for the foolishness. So I'm just gonna make sure that my hair <laughs> is hydrated. 2020 is already negative enough, you know? Okay. <laughs> I don't need any extra negativity, praise God. I'm gonna be taking for the first time this Defining Custard Twist and Hold by Cream of Nature. I don't know if I, I don't know if I've used this before. All right, so clearly I'm gonna go around and continue putting on the leave-in conditioner and just, you know, prepping my hair. I just, I'm just, oh, I'm a little nervous. Like I'm right in the middle. Like I'm having high hopes, but then like I'm not as negative with, with this product only because I've seen good things over the years. I've just never felt the need to purchase it. So I feel like it may hold my hair. I've seen it hold, you know, curls much thicker than mine or even tighter than mine and people love it and swear by it. So I think it's gonna perform well. However, I just, I don't know, I just, I'm debating if I wanna go ahead and use a cream. I will layer on my product when I'm doing styles such as leaving it alone in a back ponytail, top knot, and you know, with my wig on or whatever. So I'm thinking I wanna do that. I think I'm gonna do that. All right, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and take the buttercream. I did this in my last video with my breakout, if y'all saw that video. I really like it, and if you've never used it before, it has a very nice, floral scent. It does seem to really kind of melt in my hair. So it is hydrated, correct? Uh-huh. Well, we're gonna still move on to this cream of nature. It smells like your typical cream of nature products. It's very thick. I didn't expect that, okay. So I'm not really caring about definition because it's gonna go in a bun. However, it would be nice to have it a little shiny. You know what I'm saying? So pick, oh, hello. Oh. Y'all see how it weighed my hair down? And typically with custards, you get more moisture feel to your hair. So I tend to stick to them, even though I'm like anti-custard anything for a wash and go. So that my hair doesn't keep expanding because I didn't really get my roots. I'm gonna go ahead and take my satin scrunchie and just place this up so that I can kind of stay compacted and not rise up. Ooh, look at the curl. 
Okay. So I have not, oh Jesus, this is just, why did they, who sat around a table and was like, we gonna, we gonna call it gorilla stuff. Uh, it is just, as a mother, this is just. So it doesn't really have like a smell to it. But of course, I mean, you can only imagine. Anywho, it's nice and thick. She, oh, I got my hair. This is a disaster, hold on. I mean, I'm sure many of you guys have used this, but just in case you have not, it is very, of course, sticky. Okay, praise God. Um, all right, so we're just go ahead. feels like almost like a grease like and rub it together and apply it oh it is just messy everywhere I see like my little curls like not really staying down every time I push it down it tends to come back up. See, look, there we go again. So I'm gonna take my dimming brush, and just kind of smooth it in. I mean, it's slicking it down. It's it's slicking it down. It's not like sticky like I thought it was gonna be. Hmm. Hold on. So far, I can go back and forth, and it's not really budging. Well, a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna brush out my little teenage hairs. Almost out the house hairs. The good Lord gave me a canvas. You know, his glory is immense, okay? We just gonna give him his praise and have at it, you know what I mean? So here we go. I think the gorilla snot is, is pretty good. For now, I'm very particular about my edges, huh? Okay, and I don't have no shame. You no, know, people be, you know, shaming people. Hold on, I'm Instacarting right now, multitasking. And I have makeup on, so that's probably, that probably wasn't smart. That wasn't smart, Raina. It wasn't smart. I really like this doggone Gorilla Snide. I like the application of it. It's not sticky. Um, I'm not mad at this. Like, I, I'm really not upset. All right, so I got brought you guys a little bit closer. As you can see, it is like super sleek and it's not reverting. There's only a few things that will make my hair super sleek and gel is not one of them. Gel, I stopped using gel on my uh, ponytails like this because it just reverts my hair. It doesn't keep it sleek. I'm just be so jealous of y'all who be giving those little like waves. Like it's so funny, like everybody be wanting like the opposite of what they have. I love the wave look because my hair just looks like it's straight um, when it's back. And sometimes I'm going for that look and then sometimes I'm not, okay? Someone's at the front door. So I know y'all can't see this on camera, but it is like sticking up some areas. I just think after I put my scarf on, I'll be okay. I think this is great and I'm glad that I've actually tried it. I love the fact that it says it's, it reactivates with water. Yeah, I just have been very curious to try that and I thought why not try it on camera and you know, just in case you guys have never tried it and have been curious and just have been like me who have seen it in the aisles and was just like, mm, you know, seen it in videos and just like, mm, and you just weren't sure. I feel like, for the price, it's like $2.99. I feel like, hey, for the price, it's great. It's very accessible. Number one thing that I love is accessibility. So it's accessible, they have different versions. Again, I am preaching to the choir because y'all already noticed, I'm assuming you do. And then it doesn't give you, you know, hard 
crunchy, super sticky hair. And that's very surprising because that's what I was expecting. I have not seen any flakes, um, nothing like that so far. So I like it. And I just wanna show you guys really quick. Just woke up, so my hair looks like this, right? It actually reactivates the product. So, so far, y'all, I really like this. Um, I don't think I can show y'all. I'm headed to the gym and I'm trying to hurry up. So, let me just see if you guys can see. There is a little bit of flaking and it's old. But since I'm going to the gym, I'm not gonna be doing anything spectacular. But I do want to brush this up, obviously. But yeah, y'all, I thought I needed, hello, I thought I needed, okay, to apply product, but I don't. And it literally slicks back. And I've been doing this for a couple of days. And look, look at that, y'all. So, I just wanna come on here before I end the video. This is a few days later. Um, but this is still the Gorilla Snot. And to me, I noticed the Gorilla Snot works a lot better when um, you lay your hair down with uh, a scarf. It really gets it nice and sleek. So all I'm doing is taking my satin scrunchie. There is my bun, okay? And then with this, I am not going to do anything but just add water. And probably put it behind my ears because it's like sleek. Hello? Hello, I have to, you know, nail down. Just water, so yeah, that, I do like this night. I just wanted to update you guys. So that's it, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see y'all in my next video.